guys, I'm Pixel Dan, and today we've got ourselves a special retro toy rewind blind bag opening. You guys might remember a line called Boglins, right? There are these creepy, weird little puppet hand dudes uh, that Mattel released in the 80s. Really cool, really rad toys, but did you know that there were also Boglins minifigures? Why, yes, there were. Now, these weren't actually released in these blind bags here in the U.S. These are actually uh, were released overseas in the early 90s. I believe it was uh, 1992. And you can see they weren't put out by Mattel, but rather uh, Giachi Preziosi. I don't know if I pronounced that right, but I'm pretty happy because, look, I got myself five little bags of these mini Boglins. Uh, great, never been opened, little blind bags, and I'm really anxious to tear into them here today, because these are very, very cool. Uh, it's crazy, like, these have, um, actually shown up recently on eBay. I just bought a bunch of them off of there, because they were pretty affordable. I wanted to, uh, check them out for myself. I wanted to add some of these mini guys to my collection, so let's rip them open right here on camera. Let's see what we get. Cool little vintage blind bag opening. Here we go. Tear into these bags here. Okay, I'm gonna start here. I'm gonna, before I pull the figure out, oh, he's falling out. Because we got a little checklist. Now we also get a card. And I don't believe that the card matches the figure within. But we'll find out. You can see the card's got spew. Look at that. He's actually got some classification stuff going on down here. Uh, and then we got our guide. So this is our guide. Look at that. We got little illustrations of all the characters. This is cool. So here we go. First figure is... Oh, nice. Look at this guy. Oh, he totally whacked himself with a mallet. Look at his finger. It's all swollen. So these guys, you can see, they're kind of squishy. Really great sculpts, though. Totally retain that Boglin style. Look at that. So let's see if I can find this guy on our checklist here. Let's see if we can figure out what his name is. Oh, we got some more on the back. There he is. He has been identified as Captain Trog. <laughs> You see, he's the little guy. He's purple on there, but we got a yellow figure, and he totally smashed his finger, so it's all swollen. <laughs> really cool. I love this guy. See, and of course, he doesn't match the card. The card's different. Spew. Okay, so there's one down. Here we go. Bag a number a two. Let's see what we get. So let's start with a card. This card is Kug. He's got himself a little knife there. These are some very violent Boglins. <laughs> that guy's got a knife. Oh, check this dude out. Oh, he's got a bomb. <laughs> I love it. You got that same Boglin style there. Very cool. Really neat design. Let's see. What's this guy's name? We got to find the guy with a bomb. Find the guy with a bomb. That shouldn't be too hard, right? He's got this big, giant bomb. There he is. His name is Plag. I love these names. Plag. The Boglin with a bomb. Another yellow one. Bright yellow. Well, Bomba. I love it. <laughs> So cool. Okay, there we go. So we got those two there. King Trog. We got Plag. Here we go. Bag number three. Let's see what card we got first. The card is Trup. He's got like an arrow going through his ears, <laughs> which is crazy. And our minifig is... Oh, we got a nice red one. Oh, I love this one. He's all like boogity, boogity, boogity. Ah. Boogity, 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 boogity. Oh, look at that. That's so cool. All right, let's see what we can find him on here. Look at our guy. There he is, Blarf. His name is Blarf. Blarf, Blarf, Blarf. Apparently, I just made up a voice for this guy. <laughs> so cool. Okay, here we go. Number four. I love these guys. These are so great. Okay, here we go. We got a card. Uh, Tongue. Sweets. His name's Tong, and his tongue's sticking out. Oh, look at this dude. He's all melted. I love it. Uh, this guy's name is Tat. He's right here. He's holding a candle, and he's, like, melting like the candle. Like, he's made of wax. Look at that. So he's way different looking than the rest of these guys because he's got a very flat bottom there. Looks like he's melting, holding on to that candle. Another yellow one. I've got one red and three yellow so far. All right, here we go, my friends. The final bag. See what we get in our vintage Boglins here. I love it, love it, love it. Okay. Oh, so we got uh, Clang. There's a card there. Another is a sword wielding Boglin. And we got that checklist. Here we go. Last one. Oh, he's stuck in there. Oh, he's like silver. 
Look at this guy. Weird. He's like totally poking uh, his eyes. So he's got like two eyes over here. Totally gross. Wow. Let's see if we can find this guy in here. I love the silver color. I feel like I got something special since he's all silver. Let's see what we got going on here. So I don't know if I'm missing something, but I totally don't see this guy on here anywhere. So I guess maybe he, this is one that's missing from the instructions or from the, uh, the little checklist here. Like he's a couple guys that look like it could be him, but it's not, you know, like they're, they're shaped slightly different. So I don't know. I'm missing him. I seriously, I'm like looking all the way through this and I don't see this guy on the checklist. So I don't have a name for him. I don't have a name. I'm just going to pretend he's the leader because he's silver and he's really cool looking and he's, uh, he's, he's got two eyes coming out of one eye socket, which is kind of gross. But hey, there you guys go. That is what the uh, vintage 1992 Boglins minifigures look like. Uh, really, really fun little minis. Great set here. Uh, really happy to be able to pick up some vintage figures like this for a good price uh, and open them up. It's a lot of fun. I never had any of these, of course, bef uh, when I was a kid because uh, they weren't released here, but really glad I'm able to add some of these to my collection now. So check them out if you're a minifigure collector. Maybe hop on eBay, see if they're still available. Um, like I said, these popped up in a... In the, the seller had multiple, so I just bought five of them. So there you guys go. A look at some vintage Boglin minifigures. Hey, if you guys enjoyed this video, why not hit that like button? And also subscribe so you never miss out on a review. Until next time, my friends.